everybody, this is Praxis, and I'm here on site again in the area where the lumber is allegedly going to get deposited. Uh, I don't know if this is the contractor's version of it being all done. Uh, there's kind of a flat section over here behind you, but over here there's like this three foot, foot tall pile of, it's kind of like rock ice right there. Uh, I know when a, a lumber usually gets delivered, the, the truck will back up, it'll tilt its back, and it'll kind of like drive out from under the lumber, the lumber slides off the back, and I mean, it's not going to be able to just drive right up and over something like this, so I, I think this needs more work. I, back behind you, it looks like it's just kind of piles of snow, and you, you put the lumber, lumber on that, and then it melts, and it's going to like all destabilize. I don't know, I got to get in touch with them, but you know, it's coming along. They've tr trimmed out some more trees through here, uh, having them stack them back over here because I'm thinking about at some point maybe doing a lumber mill and using that stuff for building material not on this house I just want to get this house up but for outbuildings extra things like that so I got to get in touch with them but things are moving forward and uh, you know it's the same kind of holding pattern but in a few days it's looking like we are still going to get some warming and you know if the concrete people stop screwing us over and just not showing up we're gonna have another window where hopefully we can put up walls and this site will dramatically change in the way that it appears when we come here every day. So, fingers crossed, inside the mitten. It's very cold today. That's it, thanks for watching.